Finally tonight, we're not on next weekend because I'll be in Iowa for the Iowa caucuses. But since I have no idea how a caucus works, I asked Joanne to make a uh, video using simple words and images that even my tiny little brain could understand. Roll tape, tape rollers. The Iowa caucuses start with voters gathering in local meeting spots like a hot tub or a gymnasium. Sometimes representatives give a speech to convince you to abandon the candidate you came to support. For Republicans, it's simple. You vote using a secret ballot. Votes are counted and announced publicly and added to the statewide tally. Pretty easy. And you're home in time to watch the West Wing. Oh, cool. Martin Sheen rocks. For the Democrats, it's like a bloody battle royale. Oh. Okay, maybe not that violent. First, caucus goers break up into groups depending on who they support. Think of it like the corners of your high school cafeteria. You've got jocks, dorks, goths, goth jocks, jock dorks, dork goths, whatever. Any candidate without enough support is deemed unviable, aka a loser. Sorry, Marty, this will probably be you. But the good news for Bernie and Hillary, those voters are now up for grabs like a free sample at Costco. They have the option to switch teams, and this is where you get a chance to convince your neighbors to support your candidate instead. If you're hot, this will be easy. Hey, big boy, want to go to college for free? Another way to win people over is to tempt them with cookies. Yeah, cookies! Once people change sides, a new count is taken. Viable candidates win their share of those all-important delegates and take one step closer to the White House. That was enlightening, Joanne. Thank you so much. Okay, we gotta we gotta go. Pete, great job. Ebony, awesome. Andrew, fantastic. Joanne, eh, yeah, I'm kidding. And Catherine, always a pleasure. So we're back Saturday, February 6th. I'm Greg Gutfeld. I love you, America. <laughs>